after Hollywood leftist Rosie O'Donnell tweeted to House Speaker Paul Ryan RWISC, you will go straight to hell you screwed up fake altar boy, Reverend Franklin Graham remarked that O'Donnell does not hold the keys to hell, and added that hell is going to be filled with people who rejected God's offer of salvation and who rejected his laws. On December 23, Speaker Ryan tweeted, at the end of each year, no matter how short or long it may feel, there is always Christmas. Waiting for us is THTA sense of wonder the shepherds felt when the angels appeared in the night sky to herald the birth of a savior. Response, Rosie O'Donnell tweeted on deck. 25, Paul Ryan don't talk about Jesus after what you just did to our nation with tax cuts you will go straight to hell you screwed up fake altar boy Judas much. House Speaker Paul Ryan RWISC, and left-wing activist Rosie O'Donnell, screenshot, FNC, YouTube Today, December 26, Rev. Graham posted on Facebook, Rosie O'Donnell is back in the news today for going after Speaker of the House Paul Ryan on Twitter after he posted a Christmas video message honoring the birth of Jesus Christ. Among other things, she told Speaker Ryan he was going straight to hell. Rosie, you don't have the keys to hell, but I know the one who does, said Rev. Graham, and I can tell you who will be there. Hell is going to be filled with people who rejected God's offer of salvation and turned their backs on his laws and standards, refusing to repent. Jesus Christ is God in the flesh, and he took your sins and mine to the cross, dying in our place, so that we might live if we would turn from our sins and put our faith in him, said the reverend. I hope one day you will put your faith and trust in Jesus Christ and let him heal your heart, clean up your mouth, and forgive your sins. Do that today, you'll never regret it. O'Donnell, a lesbian and LGBT advocate, was married to Kelly Carpenter. The marriage dissolved in 2004 and then to Michelle Rounds, a marriage that ended in divorce in 2015. In 2017, the 46-year-old Rounds committed suicide. O'Donnell has five children, some adopted and some created through artificial insemination. She is an advocate for adoption of children by homosexual couples. The 55-year-old O'Donnell has an estimated net worth of $120 million. Rosie O'Donnell and her second ex-wife Michelle Rounds, enjoying your CNSnews.com article? The MRC is not funded by the government like NPR but as a non-profit, your tax-free contribution will keep the MRC your conservative premier media watchdog support us today by completing the form below. Enjoy your article.